It's considered one of the tastiest crab species in the world. The mangrove crab earned India close to 13 million US dollars in export earnings in 2015. Crab farming is not new to coastal Maharashtra, but in areas like Sindhudurg, the rapid depletion of mangrove forests is destroying the natural habitat in which these crabs thrive. Since 2012, supported by the United Nations Development Programme and the Maharashtra Forest Department, men and women from a fishing village in Sindhudurg have begun crab farming, earning higher incomes and conserving the rich biodiversity of their area. The partnership is supported by the Global Environment Facility. Sindhudurg is one of the most biodiversity rich coastal regions in India. Through a partnership, we have shown that uh, alternative livelihoods that are sustainable also provide an incentive to conserve biodiversity. Crab seeds are grown in crab nurseries set up by the project and stocked in grow out ponds or pens. They are raised on an artificial diet until it's time to harvest. Crab is from RGC or Tamil Nadu. We send it from वो करीबन 0.5 mm के इतना रहता है इतना छोटा रहता है यहां पर लाके हम उनको इसमें बढ़ाते हैं जिसको नर्सरी करते हैं करीबन 32 45 डेज हम इनको यहां पे रखते हैं और आ, इसका साइज करीबन हम 2.1 to 3 सेंटीमीटर इतना करके हम बाहर आ, जो हमारा लोकल कम्युनिटी है यहां का उनके लिए हम वो दे देते हैं वहां पे वो कल्चर के लिए आगे as the sun sets and high tide sets up, the seeds are released into this habitat, ideal for crab cultivation. It can take up to eight months, but there's often success for the local community. The crabs are of marketable size. Over the last two years, 45,000 crablets have been stocked in 28.5 acre land across 15 villages. It's helping women members of self-help groups earn additional income. आपन सगाई ना मजे एक कई तरी सांगु शक्तो कि आमी महिला सुन हाँ के कड़ा प्रकट जब पहले कसे पुरुष सगा करा दो ते आता महिला पन एक के कड़े प्रकट पकारु शक्तर मजे उड़ा चिकला तुन उतरों सुधा ते आता ने वगैरह कारु शक्तर मो आता महिला मजे कुटे समागे राईले लेना ये यहाँ ऐसा ही मला अभी मन आये यानी a few kilometers away from this village. Women of Vadatar village have a similar story to narrate. Here, groups of women can be seen beading together oyster shells on erect bamboo frames. Their faces reflect sheer contentment, secure in the knowledge that this year's yield will surely fetch them good returns. <laughs> These women have been introduced to bivalve farming technique, which involves building a bamboo raft from which ropes of one meter bearing five clusters of empty oyster shells are hung. The raft is deployed in the creek by tying it to fixed bamboo poles. The spat gradually settle on the empty oyster shell and start growing by feeding on planktons and other organisms present in the creek water. <laughs> आणि जास्त बाहेरच्या हेला विकला माल गेला तर आम्हाला 20 25000 वरती उत्पन्न मिळेल आणि आमचं हे आ पैसे मिळवून आमच्यामध्ये एक प्रकारचा आत्मविश्वास निर्माण झाला The first harvest of 6000 oysters yielded close to 1000 US dollars for 125 kilograms of meat This is 9 times the initial investment 
the potential is enormous. India can be a significant player in the years to come because uh, we've got enormous water bodies, virtually unpolluted. So all these areas, we too can come up, maybe in the top 10 um, uh, bivalve growing nations of the world. And that is what is our ultimate aim, to uh, make India's presence felt in the bivalve medical map of the world.